now the next topic we are talking is glycogen how the glycogen is made what is glycogen why we are making it how we are going to utilize it these all the questions will be answered in this lecture so first thing first what is the glycogen is all about see when you eat the food most of the time we are eating a lot of glucose and that is basically i will refer as extra glucose because all the glucose molecules which we are eating they are not going to be consumed at the same time they are not going to be burnt at the same time because we don't want that much amount of energy the amount of the glucose consuming we are we are consuming more but liver is very smart what the liver will do is whatever extra glucose you are consuming all these glucose molecule will reach in your liver and the liver will say that okay these are the extra glucose molecules which are coming and the liver will start conserving them the liver will try to save this glucose molecule so the liver in the liver we have a special protein on this special protein we are going to attach this glucose molecules and we are going to make a big molecule this glucose molecules will be attached 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 and we are going to make a large molecule this large molecule is referred as glycogen and we are going to store our glycogen in the liver so the liver is the one who makes the glycogen and will store the glycogen now once the glycogen is stored see why we are storing it because in future when we are going to go into fasting state at that time we will be requiring the glucose and the energy we can break the glycogen we can get the glucose back and that will run over the body things in our cells the reactions will happen we'll get the energy at the fasting state and the liver is making the glycogen it is storing the glycogen and who will requires the most of the energy it is the muscle so the what the muscle what the liver will do is the liver will say to the muscle that i am having a molecule you can keep it with you whenever you want the energy you can cut this molecule that will give you the energy you can generate the the glucose molecules the molecules which you can do the glycolysis and you can do the uh, you can get the energy so the glycogen is synthesized and is stored in the liver as well as then it will be stored in the muscles also and some amount of glycogen can even be stored in the brain also but mainly the glycogen is there in the liver and muscle some part is there in the brain also this glycogen is also called as the animal starch because this is how we are storing the carbohydrate in our body how the plants store their carbohydrate called as starch 